Hey guys, this is going to be a quick tip on how to use uh, trim automation or volume trim in Logic Pro. And the reason you'd want to know that is, let's say you've got your mix, your mix just set, you've got your volume and, and, and your volume rides all set and it's sounding good, but you just want to bring the overall mix down in level or up in level but you don't want to lose your automation and the relative volume between your tracks. Because if your automation is set and you go over here and you move this fader, it's going to go back to what this is saying or, or, or to what this automation is written. So what you do is, and, and say we've, we've got our mix, we love it, it's perfect, but we just want to bring all of the tracks down in volume and leave the automation. You'd hit A on the keyboard which brings logic into um, automation mode. You can set another key command. You may already have that set already, but the default is A. And then if you bring your, your arrow over this little, this little box, you see automation value or trim. Okay, so we're gonna bring all of the volume down on all these tracks while keeping the automation intact. So what you wanna do is you wanna shift click the first track and then the last track and that will select all the tracks in between. We're gonna hit A, or automation mode, and if you lift, left click and hold in this box, you're gonna see that arrow, up and down arrow pop up. And then you can drag down, or up, and it's gonna bring all of uh, the relative volume with its automation down or up. And that right there, my friends, is how it's done. Uh, hope that was helpful to you. Feel free to like and subscribe. And if you have any questions or comments below, please leave them below. And have a great one wherever you are. Take care.